Yeah. Uh, yeah. As a person who is a developer, uh, who has a lot of experience with startups, uh, and uh, as a person who uh, drives the whole community, um, according to you, what are the most important skills for a blockchain developer? For developers, specifically. yeah, specifically okay. for developer, because we are uh, uh, as a guest to Lime Academy, we are teaching uh, developers. Uh, to a blockchain yeah. development. So, what are the most important skills? What are the most important skills for me? They're not specifically for blockchain necessarily. I'll try to outline some that are specific for blockchain. But for me, in general, any dev needs to be very curious. They need to be passionate about development. Um, otherwise, development becomes burden because development is a tedious task. It is not all the glamour that, that everyone thinks it is. And it's not the glamour that it looks like it is because there are times where you need to grind a lot. There are a lot of times that you have a lot of troubles. You need to persevere. You need to find new solutions. You might end up in a situation where you have done 99% of the work and you figure out that the last 1% is actually impossible. You need to essentially a clean slate. You need to destroy everything that you have worked for. And you need to be curious and you need to be passionate about development in general. Then again, it's uh, logical thinking. I love the notion of transferable skills. For me, having a logical thinking, a way for you to explain to yourself, to figure out and explain to yourself how things work is something that's an invaluable, transferable skill in any area of life. In, 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 and essentially, this is this is for me probably one of the most important engineering skills for me this is like kind of what does it mean to be an engineer for you to be able to explain to figure out and explain to yourself how something how something works and um, what's important specifically for blockchain development blockchain is moving um with the speed of light and which means that you need to be a person that's willing to spend the time to keep up to date yeah. You need to, and if you guys have not uh, heard of this already, best source for me of the latest development news is a newsletter called Week in Ethereum. So subscribe to this. There is always like every week, there are like amazing updates from different protocols for different networks for everything, like even just ideas of people that are, that are exploring. So subscribe to this, keep up to date with, with this. And um, last but not, uh, not least, it's pretty much you being kind of detail oriented, mostly because of what we spoke about in the ability of the conference. You need to be the kind of person that, if needs be, can leave no stone on her. They, you, need, you need to be the kind of person that is going to see 101% of the, of the job. You need not to leave anything to chance because there is a good idea for this portion that you have left to chance might lead to a hack, to a bug, or whatever it is. And as we spoke previously, we have no way of fixing this. Yeah. Or 99% of the time, yeah. we have no way of fixing this. So, so yeah, pretty much this is it. Yeah.